Welcome to our Battlefield 1 weapon guide. In today's episode we take a look at the M97 trench gun shotgun. We'll start by taking a look at the damage output. It works a bit different for the shotguns, since they shoot buckshot rounds. This one in particular with 15 pellets per shot. Each pellet does 8.4 damage within its maximum damage range, but after this range it drops off to 4.2 damage per pellet. This means you will kill an enemy within at least 2 shots, but up to 20 shots depending on the range. The damage is multiplied depending on the part of the body that shot. The headshot multiplier is 1.7, upper body is 1.0 and the lower body and limbs have a multiplier of 0.96. It fires 138 rounds per minute. It has a muzzle velocity of 333 meters per second. Though it has a lower automatic rate of fire, it's in the damage category almost similar to the 12G automatic. The weapon deals its maximum damage until the range of 12 meters, which is okay, and then steadily decreases to its minimum damage until 19 meters, which is a pretty short drop of range, but not as bad as for some of the other weapons. The handling isn't that important for shotguns, but we'll stuff still cover it in short. The vertical recoil is 6.3 and the horizontal recoil is for both left and right 1.05. It's quite a lot in comparison to the other weapon, but keep in mind that it's a shotgun and it doesn't matter too much. However, it does fire fully automatic and the fuel kick can be quite obstructive. The recoil decrease is 4.5 and the first shot multiplier is 1. The aim down sight spread is 0 when you're standing still, but this goes up to 0.4 when you're moving. The hip fire spread is 0.4, but goes up to 0.6 when you're moving. The spread increase per bullet is 0.3. It doesn't have too much spread, developers made it so that it's good for running gun playstyle like any shotgun should, but it's a little bit worse at it than the other shotguns. It has a magazine capacity of 5 rounds, which is standard for its class. Reload is fairly slow since it's a shell by shell reload. It takes 1000 milliseconds per shell and the total reload takes just under 6 seconds. We recommend you to reload whenever you can. It has three variants. The M97 trench gun backboard, which is the variant we've been talking about so far. It has better recoil, but faster damage drop off. The second variant is the M97 trench gun hunter, which has a tighter spread and longer range. And the third variant is the M97 trench gun sweeper, which has an extended magazine, but shorter range. We're not going to recommend class, but we do recommend you take off the bayonet as always, because it increases the ready and ADS time. The weapon is good to map maps with close range encounters like the other shotguns. Think of maps like Amiens, Argon Forest, Ballroom Blitz and Monte Grappa. We hope you now have an overview of the M97 trench gun. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed the guide, please consider leaving a rating. Uh, it helps us out a lot. Subscribe for similar content and if you have any questions, comments or constructive feedback, leave it in the comment section down below.